Hello friends, this is Manu from Technomac. Today I'm going to show you some cool tricks you can use in CMD, that is command prompt. So let's start with this video. If you find the green color bit boring, you can change the color of the command prompt by typing color space number. Numbers are assigned to some colors. The color will change according to it. If you need the list of colors, just type color space help. You will get the color and its number. If you want to clear the whole screen of the command prompt, just type CLS, it will clear the screen. Now if you want to change the prompt name from c colon slash user slash hppc to some of the your desired name, just type prompt space your desired name, I am typing as manu at the rate technomac space dollar g will change it to manu at the rate technomac. If you want to change the title name, just type title space the desired name. I'm typing as Technomac Console. It will change the title accordingly. Now I will show you how to encrypt your important files. Suppose these two are the important files you want to encrypt. Just type cmd in the address bar, the command prompt will open with the address. After type, type cipheachipper space slash e. The following files will be encrypted. The green color means that the files are encrypted. Now if you want to decrypt this files, just type CIPHER chipper space slash D. Files will be decrypted. Now to get a list of all the programs installed in your PC or laptop. To get the list of programs installed, just type WMIC space product get name. WMIC space product get name. It will take some seconds. show you the list of programs installed in your PC laptop. Now I will show you how to hide files and folder from CMD. Suppose these are the files you want to hide. If you hide this file by this method, okay. anyone can view your hidden files by clicking on the folder options view and show hidden files options. The hidden files will be visible by clicking these options. Now if you want to hide these files using CMD, just 
just go to the folder in the address bar type cmd command prompt will open with the address after that type attrib attrib space plus h space plus s space plus r the files will be hidden Now if you want to unhide these files, type attrib now minus h minus s minus r for unhiding these files. Files will be visible. You can use the navigation up down keys from moving between the commands with that you have typed. Now if you want to create a portable hotspot using your CMD. Just run the command cmd as administrator. Just type this code. Now to start hosted network, type netsh plan start hosted network. It won't start because we have not turned on the Wi-Fi. To make this command work, just turn on the Wi-Fi first. Now with using the navigation keys go to the previous command that is net slash man set hosted network mode is equal to allow this id is equal to technomac and key is equal to technomac123 type net sh plan start hosted network the hosted network is started let us check SSID SSID is equal to Technomac will be the name of the hotspot and key will be the password. Key is Techno123. Just typing the password. Sorry, I have typed it wrong. Yes, it is connected now. Now to stop this hosted network, type netsh plan stop hosted network.
will stop the hosted network. Now I will show you how to see the IP address of your following website. Just type ping space the website you want address the website. Typing as www.google.com. It will give you the IP address of the Google. Website. Because I know. Now to see the IP, DNS and other info of your internet, just type ipconfig space slash all. It will give you the details of your internet. Now if you want to copy large details from command prompt to notepad For example I am taking the details of ipconfig Just typing ipconfig first Bar Clip it will copy all the details of the IP config. Now you can paste it anywhere where you want. I am pasting it in the net notepad. You can also use the tab button to switch between your previous commands that you have typed. So this was some of the cool tricks you can use in command prompt. Hope you guys will like this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more interesting videos. Thanks for watching. See you soon in the next video.